Hey, how are you guys? This is JP Sarri. Uh, welcome again to another uh, vlog, uh, another part of my uh, drop in the hammer. Uh, first of all, I want to say uh, thank you. Thank you to each one of you for taking time to really to uh, follow my channel, to really watch my content, to leave your comments, uh, to like and subscribe. Uh, today on this on this blog, I want to talk about something that is really, um, I think that I've been thinking about it for the last few days. Uh, I've been considering a lot of those things and uh, normally, I, you know, I'm a thinker, I think a lot. Uh, sometimes I express my ideas, uh, I write them down. Uh, sometimes I just think about them, you know, for a few days uh, and consider the answers. Uh, I want to really uh, talk about the, the fact that a lot of people, and a few, a few people have always, you know, they always reach me and uh, they always ask questions concerning a lot of things. But lately I've been getting a lot of, uh, you know, like people contacting me and, and, you know, first of all saying that they appreciate my content and what I do. and But also they ask me personal questions uh, based, uh, you know, especially on the fact that uh, they would like to say, hey, you know, how can I, what do you think that I need to do in order to improve my art, my improve what I do? I would like to have more success with my my channel. I would like to have more success with my reviews. I would like to have more success with my podcast. I would like to have more success. How, how do you do it? How can I reach more people? What kind of advices can you give? And first of all, I want to say thank you to whoever uh, takes, uh, considers me a, a successful person. I, I, I really... I'm not as successful uh, when it comes about you know uh, my, my my followers, my subscribers. I really don't have a, a, a big follow up. I have a modest uh, following. Uh, I do appreciate that uh, people spend the time to follow me, uh, but I don't think I have it completely packed uh, down. That I have it, you know, you know, I really have a, uh, an answer for those questions. Uh, I'm still struggling to try to bring more uh, uh, subscribers to my channel. Uh, and you know in that struggle, you know, I'm you know, I was really battling for quite a while trying to figure it out what to do uh, Looking you know looking for for answers. There's a lot of people on YouTube there's a lot of people that they're very successful And they give you ideas and I'm trying to uh, to be honest right to figure it out Well, how in the world a lot of the people out there and then there's people that have millions and millions of followers How in the world they're so successful when reality much of their content is, is I'm not one I don't want to be offensive, but a lot of the content on YouTube is garbage uh, it's trash. A lot of the stuff out there, a lot of people, you know, they have thousands, not thousands, some people have millions of followers and all they produce is junk. And it, it's, it's disappointing and it's frustrating because I feel that, you know, there's a lot of people out there that really have a lot of potential to become great uh, bloggers, great uh, YouTubers, but they don't get a chance because they are, you know, pretty much covered by all this trash that is on, on the tube. So. It really makes it hard to navigate sometimes. Uh, but then, you know, I was really struggling and thinking, I was talking to my wife about it, says, you know, I've been doing this for two years and, you know, I don't see the result as much as I wanted to and, and blah, blah, blah. And my wife really kind of put me back on perspective. That's the reason why I love my wife. She, she said it and she said it very simply. You know, just do what you love, regardless of what people do. You know, if you really consider, if you really go after doing, so, doing something and, you do it just because of what people are gonna say, and if you can see what people are gonna do, or, or uh, uh, so and so on, and so forth, then you're always gonna have a problem. Uh, you're not gonna be able to grow. Uh, people recognize your talent. People recognize what you do, and when you do it from your heart, and that really touched me because the truth is that you know, even though I don't have a big following, all the following that I have has come to me because I have really put a lot of my heart into what I do, uh, and. I have experimented with a few things. I started with, you know, uh, collectibles. That's what I wanted to do in the beginning. Just it was just a pastime. That it was not intentional. It was I was not intending to have a channel, um, but you know, it came to me just naturally, and, and it was fun. Uh, definitely was fun, and you know, I didn't have too much, uh, too many followers. But then after I started doing. Uh, you know, comic books, that, you know, my channel exploded. A lot of people came into it and said, man, I like your content because you're one of a kind. Uh, you take time to present that. And it's not about what you think, but it's, it's about, you know, you show the art. And to be honest, I, there's not many people doing that. Yes, you know, that puts my reviews in a different 
category compared to others because my reviews, uh, especially my book reviews, are longer. It takes a little longer. I really go in detail. Uh, some people might disagree with that. Uh, some people have mentioned it before, said, you know, I don't like it because we gotta give spoilers. Uh, you know, the art, I think, it speaks for itself. You know, I don't talk about the story, uh, what is contained, but I show it. Uh, because I think people want to see it. Uh, a lot of people want to see it. And especially people that have not read these books and people are a lot younger than I, because I concentrate mainly on older books and books that nobody has no notice or, you know, they really don't, there's not a lot of information out there. And um, that's being able, I really caught the attention of a lot of people and of course my, my, my followers have increased and continue to increase. And, but you know, as you can see, I'm experimenting with through this blog, you know, it really put my face out there for people to really know me and get to know me better, uh, reviewing movies. Uh, I want to do all the things, you know, I'm really experimenting, I'm really trying, but really I'm going back to this, it's like, uh, and I want to just tell this to anybody that wants to have a channel, and wants to do anything, even if you try to increase your podcast, and you want to increase your, I don't know, your vlog, whatever you're trying to do, do what, fe you know, feels right for you. Uh, do it with your heart, regardless of what other people say or do, or if they follow you or not, little by little, everything will come. People will come to follow you, people will find your content, people will find your channel, and they're gonna fall in love with what you do because in reality it's easy to follow those, it's easy to follow those that are passionate about what they do. And if you're passionate about what you do, and you offer something that nobody else does, uh, even if it's just with your twist, if it is something that, you know, there's a lot of reviewers, a lot of people doing all kind of stuff out there, but if something that, that you offer your heart and, you, and yourself on it, people are gonna really appreciate that. So that's my advice to you, and that's actually what I want to share with you on this blog, is um, don't care too much about the numbers. Care more about the content. Care more about what you do. Try to improve every time. Learn from your mistakes. Uh, don't be afraid to try new things. Don't be afraid to, to uh, you know, to sometimes to, uh, you know, stop at some toes. Some people are not going to like what you do or what you say. Regardless, just do it anyway, if that's something that feels right for you. Uh, because don't forget this, uh, YouTube as any other uh, platform, media platform, is a way for you to express yourself and to share your thoughts and your ideas and, and, uh, and you know express how you feel to the entire world. So that's my advice for you today and for this vlog is just don't be afraid to be yourself, express yourself, take the time and, and you'll see the benefits of it in the long run or the short run, whatever, even if you only get a, a couple hundred followers, like I do, like, you know, and uh, even if you can get less than a thousand, uh, it, it is good, it's always good to, to remain, and that's something that I do with my channel. I want to stay relevant with what I do. I see so many people creating their channels and disappearing after thousands of followers because they couldn't keep up with it. And I just, I, I, I wanna be here to stay. I wanna continue doing this, and I wanna keep evolving with uh, my, my ideas, my process, um, my dreams and my vision. So, same to you. Just share your vision with the rest of the world. So, thank you for watching this blog. And on this, I drop the hammer. And I'll see you on the next video. Thank you, friends. Take care.